And what I thought I'd do, uh, because I love this story, I want to tell you the story of how less invasive cardiac techniques got started. These are the catheter-based techniques. I'm going to tell you a little bit about angioplasty, which is the, the uh, main catheter technique, the general name. And it really starts with this uh, fellow here, Charles Dodder, who was not at Stanford. He was a radiologist at the University of Oregon. And uh, quite a character. You can get a flavor for it. The, uh, the picture on the right is from Life magazine. Uh, he was uh, known by some of his colleagues as Crazy Charlie. And he, he was uh, clearly one of the most brilliant uh, uh, physicians, interventionalists uh, that, that this country or the world has known. And I found recently a movie uh, that he made in uh, 1967. I'd like you to, to just uh, listen to this. Can we bring the audio up? Do we have audio on this? Intermittent claudication. His arteriogram shows a sharp localized narrowing in the left superficial femoral artery. Can you hear that okay? Atheromatous obstruction. Vascular surgery could remove or bypass it but there ought to be a better approach, and there is. Transluminal angioplasty. Here, the first look shows the stenosis. Now to thread the guide through it, always under fluoroscopy and with care. The patient watches. This time it practically fell through. It's not always this easy. The stenosis is gone. It looks like we have it made. Yeah, it looks good, but let's not count our chickens for another day or so. He had a right to be pleased. That's it. A little under 45 minutes. So here his blood pressure is about 20, Next day, probably. He's on his you feet. see him, he's sweating and... This part I love, Three watch this. Three around and still no pain. Looks like my ream job's working. Amen. He's wrong in calling it a... So uh, I, I just wanted to give you a flavor. This, this guy was incredibly entrepreneurial. He never commercialized uh, any of these technologies. But this was the first time that a major surgical procedure, uh, you know, uh, before his coming along, they would have cut open the leg and, and had to do a bypass or gotten that stuff out. And he's doing this with catheters. He's, he's putting in progressively larger catheters and dilating it up. Absolutely far ahead of his time.